Ryan, what a day this is for you in your young career. You're signing for Mansfield until the end of the season on low from Birmingham, your parent club. And in a few hours' time, you could be playing on this glorious pitch behind you in the friendly tonight. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, it's a massive day for me, obviously, signing for a club of this stature. Um, obviously, I've been at Birmingham now for quite a, quite a long time, and it's just great to get out on loan and, and experience a club like this and like, hopefully play a, a lot of football this season. Tell us about your background in the game. Uh, yeah, so I started out as, as a young boy, five or six, playing football, obviously. Got scouted for Birmingham, age nine or ten. Been with them throughout the academy. Um, yeah, it's been a great time at Birmingham throughout the whole academy. The coaches have helped me develop into the player I am today. Uh, played for the 23s last season, and obviously got a couple of games at the back of end, uh, back end of last season for the first team. But yeah, also played for Wales 21s. Have been with them for for a number of years now. So yeah, it's good. What was that like getting a couple of first team appearances for the Blues yeah it was brilliant uh, to step on the pitch and uh, to play games for them um, obviously it's, it's the next level from the 23s it's a lot faster but yeah I felt I was ready and I, I felt like I'd done well enough in them games and now I'm just I'm delighted to be here and obviously get started with Mansfield did that whet your appetite for regular first team football yeah definitely um, them two games give me a boost to Obviously, play more games. I just I can't wait to just play men's football now in a, in, a, in a proper squad, senior squad, and get as many games as I can. A young international footballer as well. That, that must be a really beneficial experience for, for, for a player of your young age. Yeah, definitely. Playing for the 21s, it's, you get experiences that some players may never get. Um, playing internationally against top teams. And, yeah, it's, it's the next step up again. Obviously, the, the standard of that is... Is really good. Um, all the players that you're playing with are really good, and it's good to have that on my CV as well. Just to play for Wales 21s, it's, it's an honour for me, and it's yeah, it's great. And you know Ryan Burke well, don't you? Who is here at Mansfield? He signed some weeks ago from Birmingham City, your parent club. Did you speak to Ryan uh, prior to your signing? Yeah, I've been with Ryan since since I was 16, the scholar days at Birmingham, and he's a great lad. Uh, yeah, I spoke to him on the phone a couple of days ago and he said what a great club it is and how he's really enjoying his time here and he says oh, if you sign here you'll, you'll have a good time obviously it's good um, the gaff is brilliant with him he says so yeah I can't wait to get working with him as well sounds like a glowing reference <laughs> yeah <laughs> you know he, he's come up here and he took that step and he's finding it really good here so yeah talk to us about you as a player uh, I'm a centre mid uh, play CDM obviously um I'll get the ball down, I like to play forward as, as soon as I can. After transition, I'll, I'll play into the strikers' feet or in behind for them. I'll give them, I'll give them opportunities, hopefully, to go and do what they do and score goals. The manager here seems to like playing a midfield diamond. Where do you see yourself fitting in in that diamond? Yeah, um, I could play either bottom of the diamond in front of the back four or left side or even right side, um, I don't mind. But um, yeah, I've played the diamond before for the 23s at Birmingham. That our coach likes the diamond as well, so yeah, I've, I've played in there, I know the role as well, so hopefully yeah, I'll fit in perfect. And what main attributes will you bring to this midfield? Uh, passing, playing forward as soon as I can, uh, balls in behind for the strikers, um, but off the ball as well, I'll, I'll work hard, I'll give 110% every game to, to win the ball back and play forward, yeah. What are you perhaps expecting from football in League Two? Are you anticipating it to be a bit more physical than you used to? Yeah, definitely. Um, the people I've spoke to about League Two, they said it's a next step up for your physicality. You have to be strong, and I will. I'll do that. I'll get around the pitch. I'll put challenges in. I'll, I'll win headers or whatever, and then I'll win the second balls as well. And then I'll like to move out and get playing. And how do you see the challenge ahead of you? Because there's some really impressive midfield players here at this moment in time yeah it's going to be a challenge uh, like I said I'm, I'm going to have to come in and work for my place if, if I get a chance I'll take it um, but yeah I'll work hard every day in training and I'll show the gaffer what I'm about and hopefully I, I can get into his starting 11 and it'll be the first season back with supporters inside the stadium that's got to be something you're looking forward to yeah, greatly yeah I can't wait like I said uh, the games at the end of last season there was no fans so I'm looking forward to playing here in front of the fans and showing them what I'm about and hopefully 
get the results that we need and, and to win games, yeah. A quick glance at the watch tells me we're about four hours away from kick-off. What will you be doing now till then? Oh, obviously, I'll go back outside. I'll settle down a bit after this because it's been a bit, a bit mad morning. But, yeah, hopefully if I'm involved tonight, it'll be good. And I can't wait to see the fans here. Best of luck. Thank you.